Hey guys, welcome back to the Novice Tech. In today's video, I'm going to show you a quick tutorial on how to jumpstart your power supply. There are many reasons why you want to jumpstart your power supply. One reason is when you're doing a water cooling build and you want to do a leak test. So you don't fry your motherboard and GPU. Second reason is if you had bought a set of LED fans or, or this CPU water block that have LED lights, you want to test them out to make sure that all the LEDs are working. The worst thing that can happen is if you install everything and you find out the light doesn't work. And don't forget to click the subscribe button with the bell notification. It would help me out a lot. So let's get started. So you have two ways of doing it. The first way is you can either go on Amazon and buy one of the jumpers like this one. To make life easy, the jumper is already attached to the adapter for you. And this one came in the box when you purchased a Seasonic 1000 watt Platinum. They know that you would probably need to use it in order to get your build working properly. It's technically plug and play. Or you can use a conductive metal wire like this one or a regular paper clip. So first grab your PSU. It's very important that the clip needs to be facing you since you probably have a custom cable, you won't be able to see the, the ground and power. You're going to count one, two, three, Four, and that's your live cable. Put one end in your live cable, and then the next pin to the right of it is usually your ground, so insert your other end in it. Next, plug in your Molex or SATA cable to the PSU. Then, turn on the power switch at the back of your PSU. And there you have it. Power is on, and I can see that one of my LED at the top of the CPU block is blinking. This probably means it's going to die pretty soon. So I'm going to turn this off for now and show you how this bridge tool works. This is the most easiest way. Just plug in and switch the power on. And just like that, it powers on. No need to count the pins. Either way, it will work. So that's pretty much it. Simple way to jumpstart your PSU. And don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment below. 